Hi, hello, welcome back to my channel, Govind English Teacher. Today, we have an interesting, an important, an excellent speaker, a great communicator, a, a good personality with us is... Uh, hi, hello, welcome back to my channel. Today, a great personality is with us and uh, we, are, we are going to discuss something, uh, uh, the grammar and the fluency, the communication skills and the confidence level okay uh, sir welcome back to my channel please introduce yourself sir thank you sir my name is nataraj i'm, I'm i live in bangalore and uh, i'm working for xyz company and then my father my father is working in police department yes recently he got a uh, retirement thank you for your uh, a small uh, brief introduction about you uh, sir let mm -hmm. me ask some questions to you sir how long have you been practicing english language and uh, how you learn English language? Yeah. Mm, sir, actually, I studied in completely Kannada medium. I live in Karnataka. My local language is Kannada. Kannada. And my mother tongue also Kannada. So, mm, I'm good at Kannada language, but uh, what to do? Uh, while I study my school days and college days, uh, uh, I was suffering because of my poor English skills. And not only that, uh, after my graduation, I attended uh, many interviews, I failed in many interviews and I was going with my friends. Uh, they, they were selecting but I was not selecting because of my poor English skills. A lot of people laughed at me be, uh, and uh, they were telling uh, you should uh, improve your English otherwise uh, you don't get job like that. Uh, they were uh, all saying and then I started learning. After my graduation I started to learn. While I was studying my school days I was uh, really so weak student in English language uh, and I failed in many times in English. After that, uh, when, I came, uh, when I came to Bangalore, my PU and my, my degree, I started here in Bangalore in Jayanagar uh, BS College. But when I passed my uh, degree, I was suffered so lot, so I, I can't tell everything because many, many of interviews I went and I failed. Uh, and everyone saying, uh, you need to improve yourself. Uh, try to try to speak confidently like that they were all saying and then I start to learn okay sir good but actually uh, thank you sir Natra sir and he came from Canada media that means uh, Canada language uh, and is yeah. uh, higher level he uh, just studied only Canada but uh, and when he went to interview you know and uh, because of English language because of like a fluency because of uh, like that that, that that much confidence in speaking English language and he was not uh, uh, given post and he was rejected so the reason he started his English journey at the age of I think uh, after after uh, uh, degree you know and now he is very, he became very fluent. But in, in the early, and uh, like that, like Natra sir, like many are from the vernacular language, you know, they feel uh, very, very, very difficult in, in learning a language. But one thing, when you are focused on, when you are uh, the uh, burning uh, desire towards English learning, learning, automatically one can learn like Natra. Now he is very fluent, now he is very confident, now he is uh, very uh, experienced, you know, so that uh, and he learn. So now, sir, uh, Natra sir, and in your uh, English language learning journey, so what are the uh, the ways? What are the tips? What are the what is the strategy that you have followed to be to come this level? Uh, please give your uh, experience. Sure, sure. Why not? Actually, I followed many uh, many of uh, many of my friend advisors. You know, you need to talk to yourself. Go with the sir. Uh, you want to talk to yourself and uh, try to talk in front of the mirror also. That is also good. And uh, once you get up in the morning, what do you do? What is your plan? Everything you need to talk to yourself. Uh, now time is 10.30. What I need to do? After after one hour, two hour, everything you should plan, sir. And before go to bed. And you need to tell what I have done in the morning. Everything you should talk in English only because my mother tongue is Kannada. If I uh, think in Kannada, Kannada will come automatically from my mouth. If I think in English, uh, the biggest problem is we are not thinking in English. If you think in English, definitely you can. If, if you think in English, you can definitely speak. See, if you have everything here, it will come out of your mouth. When you don't have here, it will not come, right? So, all the time, so all the time, try to think in English. That's my good advice to everyone. I used to do, and uh, every day I do like that. And uh, I do. Uh, in the beginning days, you will get so problem only in the beginning days. 
but once you cross uh, beginning days after that uh, once you come to intermediate level definitely you uh, you can speak very good english but um, and uh, it's all depend upon your interest if you have interest definitely there is no age for to learn any language to learn anything new and don't worry about uh, making mistakes mistakes uh, without making mistakes you can't learn anything new if you are not uh, making any mistake it means you are not learning anything new so learn from your mistake and your best teacher is your last mistake i think yes sir your last mistake must be your best teacher uh, good sir actually anyone can learn anything in the world you know by making mistake by uh, allow to mistake to by loving mistakes and by allowing mistakes one can overcome slowly day by day every day and uh, they, uh, one can uh, learn fluency so that's a good sir actually uh, in your uh, opinion told that and talking oneself is important also and and uh, do something before mirror just practice something mirror is a good and also and every moment you have to use you have to sync the situation and day to day work of life automatically what will happen and we have to make english language like our mother tongue so when you think in english that's how to think in english language because of with the basic words with the basic grammar so initially you should not uh, worry about the grammar i think is just whatever you want to say i have to express uh, something so before going to uh, bed you have to write something by writing a diary also it will affect uh, it it will uh, uh, develop our language fluency also that's good sir actually and you are, you you learn like that so that uh, and those who passionate those who are desire to learn english language if you are determined to learn english language nobody can stop you if you are not determined nothing will help you so that determination the passion and the devotion also the burning desire the interest and the focus and uh, Uh, if you use your time in a productive way possible way peaceful way automatically everything will, can be possible like that uh, natra sir and uh, even though he came from kannada media but he in the earlier stage he, he has suffered a lot but he, he could have uh, achieved his uh, fluency now he is uh, speaking very well without hesitation and also uh, when you uh, develop your confidence level automatically one can uh, uh, excel oneself in a, in, a, in a in extending way in a, in a in a good way great way like that uh, and uh, how natra sir uh, le- learned language like that anybody anybody anyone can learn english language so it is very easy and to learn english is very crazy so that the passion that makes you and that uh, gives the confidence uh, one can uh, excel one's uh, communication skills this is my uh, interaction with us uh, our natra sir oh. natra sir and uh, actually sir thank you natra sir for your uh, good and great experience your experience will help other people and they can learn like you if they follow if you they follow that your strategy your tips your tricks and your methodology your way of learning so that uh, and it, your uh, experience will boost many other uh, learners or beginners so that uh, uh, sir your words are great inspiring and mot- a great mobilizing and motivating and uh, okay sir uh, one can inculcate uh, like this habits uh, by following that tips because you know uh, sharing experiences uh, uh it means so uh, it's a wonderful for teaching you know uh, thank you sir yeah. anything you want to add natra sir sir i am so lucky because i have a great teacher like you and uh, after a long time i spoke with you i know you uh, since 2 years but uh, i like your way of talking and your attitude your smiling face yes, uh, sir. you are so you are so kind also i heard about you and many of my friends also they they used to tell about you about going there sir is very uh, fantastic man he know about everything about spiritual and all kind of things uh, they said really you are a, you are an inspiration to young people uh, thank you sir thank you for your good words great words and uh, uh, great kind words and which makes me which boost up my confidence and so that i will make many videos uh, to <laughs> influence other people uh, by way of my uh, uploading you know uh, thank you sir thank you for uh, sharing and your uh, good ideas and thank you for sparing your time and thank you for coming to my live session and thank you sir once again good luck sir bye see bye. you later sir bye